Hi, I'm Jennifer Renneser. Wedding season's coming up and brides are constantly looking for ways to personalize their big day. So today I'm going to show you how to make a tool headpiece. It's the perfect accessory for brides, bridesmaids, or flower girls. So the total cost of the craft is under $10. It's only going to take you about 20 minutes to make a headpiece. And then in order to get started, you only need a few materials, which is a roll of tool and then a headband, or you can do combs, depending on how you want to secure it to your hair. Um, and then you're also going to need some tools, which include a ruler, scissors, and a hot glue gun. Step one, cut 12 pieces of tool into eight inch strips. Step two, cut six inch piece of twine and set aside. Step three, layer pieces of tool on top of each other, alternating directions. Step four, fold tool in half and pinch the bottom together. Secure with twine. Step five, secure tool to headband with a drop of hot glue and hold in place until dry. So now that the headband's complete, this is what the finished product looks like. I'm going to show you a couple different variations that I did. So with this one, I actually used a birdcage tool. Same concept, same steps, um, but I really like this one because I feel like it's very much avant-garde kind of looking. Think Carrie in Sex and the City on her wedding day. She had those big feathers and that birdcage in her hair. Um, for another option, you can try to put it on a comb, but you'll only need half of the tool. So these require 12 pieces of tool. This one, you're only gonna need six. So this one here has got more of a rustic feel with the ivory tool. And then I did a lace trim at the bottom for more decorative touch and included some feathers. I think a great idea too is if you've got feathers left over, ask your florist to include it into the boutonnieres. It's a really kind of great way to tie your whole theme together. Also, I think this is a really good accessory for the bride, but consider using them for your bridesmaids or flower girls, or have the bride-to-be wear it to her bachelorette party um, or bridal shower. So if you enjoyed this tip, make sure you subscribe to my channel for more wedding tutorials.